Hey, what's up YouTubers? If you're watching this video, you probably have a Canon printer that you're trying to set up to scan to a Gmail account. Um, it's a pretty simple process, but not easy to find the instructions. So I figured I would make a quick video to uh, show how I set mine up and hopefully this will help you out. This particular printer is a Canon Image Class MF733 CDW. I assume these procedures will work on any image class Canon printer. Um, the first thing you're going to want to do to uh, set up your scan to email is find your IP address for your printer. There are several different ways to go about that, but uh, getting it right off the printer is probably the easiest, but it's not very intuitive, so let me show you how to do it. I've got some sticky notes right here just to cover up my IP address when we get to that point, um, but you get the idea here. So go to menu. And from menu, go to preferences. Once you get to preferences, go to network. And then you're going to go down to TCP IP settings. And up here at the top, IP4 settings. And then IP address settings. And then finally, check settings. So that's going to bring this up and it's going to display your IP address right here. Write those numbers down. It'll be a series of numbers and decimal points. Write it down exactly as it's listed right there. And, and then come over here to your computer. And once you get to your computer, you're going to type those numbers in up here in the address bar. Uh, I'm using Safari, but you may be using Internet Explorer. It'll work either way. But just type those numbers exactly as you wrote them down. You don't need any www or HTTP or any of that stuff. Just type them in there and press enter. And what that's gonna do is bring up the login screen for your Canon uh, printer for your, uh, change your settings and that sort of stuff. Now, you wanna do system manager mode. So, click that. When my printer was new, there is no username or password set up yet. I highly suggest you do set that up later on, but when it's new, you can just leave that blank and click log in. So that's going to bring up your uh, management page here. To set up your Gmail account, come over here to the right, click settings and registration. And on the left, the first thing we want to do is change uh, the port setting for your outgoing mail. Uh, Gmail requires a specific port. And this was something that was very difficult for me to find and get, get set up correctly. So go to network settings. And then you're going to have TCP IP settings. And kind of scroll down that list. And what you're looking for is port number settings right there. Click that one. All right, once you got port number settings, click edit. And that's going to allow you to edit them. The one you're looking for is SMTP, and that needs to be set to 587. It was set to 20 on mine, and it wouldn't work. Kept getting errors. Set it to 587, and all was good. So set that to 587, and click OK. Then come back over here to the left-hand side and go to TX Settings. And network and email or email and fax settings so again you're going to want to click edit all this will be blank whenever you pull yours up the smtp server for gmail is smtp.gmail.com so you'll type that in there then your email address that's your email address at google.com i mean at gmail.com uh, your actual email address. Don't type your email address. All right, and then you're going to leave all the rest of this blank till you get down here to the bottom. And under authentication and encryption, you're going to click use SMTP authentication right there. And then under username, again, that's your email at gmail.com. Then you're going to click set password and you're going to enter your Gmail password right here. And then finally, 
use TLS for STMP. Click that. Leave the rest of these unchecked and go up here and hit OK. And that should have you set up. You can uh, run a test and make sure that everything works right, but uh, that's the way to set up scan to email function on a Canon uh, printer for a Gmail account. Hope this helps you out, and if you do, like and subscribe. Have a great day.